Next, we're gonna take a look at how to add more categories to our store and how to add products to those categories. And then we're also gonna look at how to add those categories to the navigation menu. So here in the WordPress dashboard, let's go to products and click on categories. And here we can see two categories we've already added while creating our products. We have dresses and we have tops. And then we also have uncategorized. So for each product that doesn't have a specific category, it will automatically be assigned to uncategorized. Now, the first thing we wanna do here is add images to each of our categories. So for the dresses, let's click on edit. Then let's scroll all the way down to the thumbnail and click on upload image. Then I'm just gonna drag in all of my category images and I'm gonna choose this one for the dresses category and click use image and click update. Then let's go back and do the same thing for the tops. Now, if you wanna create a new category, we can do that right here on the left. So let's say we wanna create a best sellers category. We can enter the name here then if this is a subcategory of an already existing one, we can choose the parent category right here. And then all the way at the bottom, we can also choose the category thumbnail, the category image. So let's click here and then let's choose this image for the best sellers and click use image and then click add new category. And then we can scroll up and see that new category right here. Now I've added one more category called new arrivals. And then we can also change the order. So let's say we wanna have dresses all the way at the top, then we have tops, then we have best sellers, and then new arrivals. So now we have four categories in total, but we can see that for the new categories we've just added, there aren't any products in those categories yet. So let's look at how to add products to those categories as well. So let's go back to products. And then here, let's select all of the products we wanna add to the best sellers category. Once all of those products are selected, let's go to bulk actions, click on edit, and then apply. And then here we can see all the products that are selected. And here we can choose the categories we want to add those products to. So let's add them to the best sellers category, then scroll down and click on update. And now we can see that those products are in the best sellers and also in the dresses category, which was the original one we have added the product to. And now let's also add a few products to the new arrivals category. So select the products again, go to bulk actions, edit, apply then choose new arrivals and update. So now we also want to add our categories to our navigation menu. So let's quickly go to our website by hovering over our website name, then right click on visit site and open in a new tab. And then here we can see the navigation menu and this is where we want to also be able to navigate directly to our product categories. So let's go back to our WordPress dashboard, then let's scroll down here go to appearance and click on menus. And here we can see all of the links that we currently have in our navigation menu. Now to add our product categories, we're gonna scroll down here and then go to product categories. And now here we can see our categories. We can simply click on select all and then add to menu. Now let's click on save menu and then we can go back to our website, reload the page and now we can see all of our product categories in the navigation menu. Now you can see that this can be a lot of different links in the navigation menu, which can be quite confusing. So what I would wanna do is add those categories as a sub menu of the shop page. So to do that, we're gonna go back to the dashboard again. And then here under pages, we can now also add our shop page. So let's go to view all and then let's select the shop page and click on add to menu. Now we should see that page right here and now we can add all of the categories as subcategories or a sub menu to the shop link. So let's just drag them down here and drag them to the right a bit like this and then just do that for all of our categories. Then let's click on save menu and now let's go back to our website again, reload the page, and now we can see that we just have one more link, the shop page link, and we have all of our categories as sub menus right here. Now I actually want to have that shop link all the way on the left. So let's go back 
and drag that all the way to the top. And then again, save menu. And now we can see that the shop link is all the way on the left of the menu. 